Mike McCarthy to return as head coach of Cowboys in 2024. Based on a poll that I posted on my community tab, I would assume about 81% of you watching this video right now are pissed off. Did Jerry Jones and the Cowboys make a massive mistake? We'll answer that question along with why they would make this move after that playoff debacle. Let's get into the video. There are a couple of things that are true when it comes to the Cowboys and Mike McCarthy as their head coach. Truth number one is the Cowboys are a good team in the regular season. You can't really argue that point. Three 12 win seasons in a row. Regardless of what you believe, that is a sign of a good football team. 36 wins in three years. Some big wins, some horrific losses in there too. But it's hard to argue with them being a bad team in the regular season under Mike McCarthy. Truth number two, they are bad in January. 2021, they lose in the wild card round. 2022, they lose in the divisional round. 2023, they lose in the wild card round in horrific fashion. It's undeniable at this point that the guy getting them ready for playoff football is not good. I don't know why they're this bad at playing in January, but the track record shows us it's a problem. Truth number three, the players like Mike McCarthy. Wanye Thomas tweeted about it. Jake Ferguson did as well. I believe that Mike McCarthy is a good locker room guy. I think he has the support of that locker room. Does it make him a great coach? No. I'm sure that you had teachers in school that you really liked. A cool guy or girl teaching your math class. Did that make them a good teacher? Did it make you have better grades in that class because you liked them? I highly doubt it. I think it counts for something that McCarthy has the locker room. He has has the support of the people that are playing for him, but it isn't translating into doing better in playoff games. It isn't contributing to winning in January. And winning in January is why Mike McCarthy was hired as the Cowboys head coach. He had won a Super Bowl, he had been there, and their previous head coach and Jason Garrett had not. So if he was brought in to win playoff games, why is Jerry Jones making this move now? And I think there are a couple of reasons why the Cowboys are keeping Mike around for another year. Year. But we're just going to talk about the main point in this video. Jerry fears regression in order to get better. He hates the thought of moving on and this team being worse in 2024. And guess what? It's extremely likely that the Cowboys would get worse if they fired Mike McCarthy. It's more likely that they win less than 12 games than winning more with a new head coach. But with Jerry's inability to move on, you're stuck in this weird gray area where you aren't getting over the hump anytime soon, especially not with Mike as the head coach. You're stuck winning 12 games, getting to the playoffs, and then getting dismantled by a better team than you or an inferior team like we saw a week ago. That's where they're stuck at as a team. That's where we are stuck at as fans. Winning 12 games is exciting. It gives you hope for the playoff. Unlike those Jason Garrett 8-8 eight and eight teams where we were like, we're not winning in the playoffs. Those 12 win seasons give you hope and it lines Jerry Jones' pocket. He likes the hype. The Cowboys are gonna get hype next year if they win 12 games. We're gonna be having the same discussions that we had this year. But winning 12 games is awesome. It's fun for a majority of the season. But what's the point when you can't win when it matters. We've seen it work time and time again. You have to tear it down, suck it up for a little bit, and then rebuild the team. It's just a cycle of being in the NFL. But for Jerry, it's about selling us the idea every single year that this is the time that the Cowboys break through. And guess what I call that? The definition of insanity. Doing the same thing over and over and over and expecting a different result. When in reality, this team gets farther and farther away from the Super Bowl with every year that passes with this quarterback and this head coach. Mike was brought in for January. He's been handed some of the most talented Cowboys teams we've seen in the past decade. But at the end of the day, he's no different than Jason Garrett. Yeah, he wins more regular season games. Yes, the Cowboys are better with Mike McCarthy than they were with Jason Garrett. But like I said earlier, it doesn't matter when you get to January. Jason Garrett's eight and eight teams that lost in the wild card round are no different than this year's team that won 12 games. It just hurts more now because it gets your hopes up for the playoffs even more. Let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions down below in the comments. I'll be responding to as many as I can today and through 
throughout the night. So head down there and let me know. Thank you for watching. Cowboys content is on the way this offseason. So make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Thank you for watching. I love you all. Bye. <laughs>